Hi, and welcome back to Beyond Two Souls. Before we get into it, I just want to let you guys know that I'm going to drop the difficulty of the controller settings down to easy. I had it on advanced, but just to save like the pain of me getting it wrong too many times, I think it's just going to be better for everyone if I have it on easy. I've read that, that it doesn't really affect the story or the outcome, so it's just going to mean that I make less mistakes and maybe... I, I frustrate you guys less, so all right, let's see if that is going to help us today. Oh, the condenser. That's in the middle somewhere here. Jody, That's um, get up. our mate, what? Mr. Dawkins. What, what's going on? Get dressed. I'll explain in the car. Right, something's happened. She has a nice bedroom, like a teenage-style bedroom. The DPA has launched a program to study the other side. The infraquiltus, they call it. They've created a condenser, a machine oh. to open a rift to what lies beyond. Wow, what? Open the passage? Guidance wow. world? Something happened last night. Entities got through the rift oh, and we wow. couldn't shut down the condenser. Oh, no. Everybody in the building was slaughtered. None of the rescue teams came back. They called and asked for your help. I told them you were just a child, that it was too dangerous. But they know only you know how to deal with wow. what lies beyond the rift. No. Oh, this is going to be terrifying. Terrifying. Wow, wow. This is terrible. Why would they interfere? Jody, if you don't want to do it, just say. We have and to. And I'll take it back. It's all right. It's all right. I'll do it. Wow. She's incredibly brave. Incredibly brave. Even though on the inside, I think that she is going to struggle. All right. This is going to be scary. Who can't send her in there? What are you thinking? Who else is going to do it? She's the only one that can stop this. Exactly. Just going straight in to this carnage. Is that the girl? I'm sorry, Miss. I heard there's some here. Oh, yeah. I can come through here. Oh, I'm sorry. She's just a teenager. Oh my goodness. Department of Paranormal Activities. Wow. So many injured people. Oh, this is frightening. Oh my goodness. No way. They killed everything. What could that be? I'm not telling us everything. This is this is crazy. I I don't know if I'll be able to handle this. The condenser is in the lower basement. You need to find the control room. That's all they could tell me. Jody. The entities around the rift, they're not like Aiden. They're from the depths of the other side. We know almost nothing about them. I've been living with an entity that I know nothing about since the day I was born. I get it. Don't worry. I don't plan on dying today. Good. Oh, jeez. I am insanely nervous I'm scared oh this place is terrifying this is terrifying I don't think I can do it <laughs> can we no we cannot even use Iden I don't know why so we have to go into the lower you I didn't but I'm scared. Mm-hmm. We're both scared here. Damn. 
this is terrible. I know that I'm delaying going into the lower basement and I want to go. There's blood on the floor. Just absolute carnage here. Oh, jeez. I don't know. Look at all the blood. All that blood. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's awful. It's awful. Warning. I am scared. I'm very scared. I didn't sign up to play a horror game. I honestly didn't. <laughs> Can we... How do we get in there? Push the button. Okay. Come on. Gotta go to the basement. Great. Oh, the elevator's stuck. Oh. What? Okay. Go so see what you can do, Aiden. Right. Now we can use Aiden. Oh, there we go. This is very, very odd. Okay. What's that? Oh, it's stuck. I see. I see. All right. All right. Okay, so that's, that should be working now. Now, I think the reason why I couldn't move Aiden as well is because I I changed the difficulty to easy. If that's going to stop me from moving, it does. See, I've just changed it back to hard mode. I, I have to keep it on hard mode because... I want to be able to move Aiden around of my own free will. Do you know what I mean? Like, I do not want to just rely on the game to do it for me. So I'm sorry guys, you're going to have to put up with my incompetence because I need to be able to move Aiden, so I'll just, I'll just get good. Okay, I'll just get good very quickly. Oh, okay, so we have to drop down. Right. There we go. It's alright, it's alright, Jody. It's okay. I wonder if I could have moved him away as as Aiden. Damn, he's dead. I think we're gonna see a lot more of that in there. Yep. Yeah. Oh! Nice! Maybe she knew this guy. Okay, let's try and get that. That's kind of tricky too. Yep, something's happening. Oh, oh she can see what happened to him. Oh. It was that suitcase. Wow. Wow, that poor dude. That poor dude. We can't heal him as Aiden? No. Oh my goodness. Okay. Look, I'm just using Aiden here to, to check my surroundings to make sure that we're going to be safe because I am genuinely frightened. Laboratories. Oh, could I have looked? Damn, I could have looked more on that floor. Oh, man. Should have looked around more. I don't know if I can restart checkpoints or something like that, but um, yeah, that's a regret. Can I go? No, I can't go back up, hey? That's cool. Alright. Oh no, this place is awful. This. Oh jeez, I don't know if I can do this. 
I'm actually, I'm genuinely frightened. So many dead. How did he? Oh! Go! Nothing but death! Dude, that's not a nice way to tell somebody not to do something, is it? We have to go. Why can't someone else come with us? <laughs> no, we're on our own. We are on our own here. Damn. Can we? No, no, no. I just want to use our good mate Aiden to have a peek in there. What does that say? Ultrasound shower decontamination room. Oh, there's a fire. There's fire in there. Look. We can't go any further. Okay. Well, let's do it. Let's do it. This is terrifying. It's terrifying. I don't like it. There's nothing that we can do with that poor fellow. We can go in a little bit further now. Oh jeez. Okay. Well let's um let's Oh No What What on earth? I don't even wanna look. <gasps> Oh my god, no. What? You're kidding. Like, that guy. I don't know. I don't know. This is genuinely scary. Genuinely frightening. What does that do? A camera controller? I don't know what that is meant to do, but this is genuinely, genuinely bad. I'm terrified. We can't go in there. Try to open, to open it from the other side. side. How about no? There's literally fire everywhere that we can see. Joking me. What is that? That might be the door button? Okay, okay. There's also something on the computer. Alert, evacuate. So, what's that done? That doesn't. That hasn't done anything. Oh, this is awful. This is awful. I know. I can feel it too. They're here. Yep, yeah, the bad things. Yep, yep, yep. Stay close to me, okay? Mm hmm. We're gonna need your help, Aiden. We're gonna need it. Let's see what happened to this poor fellow. Yep. Call the emergency team. They're coming. <gasps> oh. the monsters those things well there's nothing that we can do I don't this is just genuinely frightening but I don't think that um, I don't think that Jody can die here you know what I mean what's the point of doing that there I don't ducks, know Right. I can get up there. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. We can't see his memories. There's, um... Oh, okay, okay. We might be able to knock that off. Yep. Thanks, Aiden. Thank you for allowing me to go to the back place. You're a gem. Okay, well, that's it. That's it for Mr. Aiden. Can we get up? Like, climb up? 
Mm-hmm. Genuinely frightening. Oh boy. Okay. Wouldn't these air ducts be very hot because of all the flames? Surely they would be like scalding her skin, right? Oh man. This is just awful. Absolutely terrible. What's that noise? Great. Now let's go. Did you hear? Like people? Yelling? I don't know what the point of that is. She's coughing. I think we need to probably get out of here fairly quickly. Alright girl, let's go. This is terrifying in here. Terrifying. Mm hmm mm hmm What's that? Poor fellow. Alright, deal with this dude. Tell me your sad story. Are you hurt? Can you move? I'm not gonna make it. Calm down. gonna do this I don't know how we're, we're gonna do this you know how are we gonna be able to get out of here there's fire everywhere there we need to be able to get through there's something something there no point in doing that Aiden well just trying trying dude Well, can we operate like, um, well, how are we going to get through that, you know? I don't know how we're going to be able to get through that. There must be something that Ida can do. <coughs> we can't get through that. I'm sorry. This is a fireman. He might have like an extinguisher. Let's see where he's put his extinguisher, huh? So maybe we're gonna need it. Stopping these entities from coming and getting her. Hey, what's stopping them from doing it? Where? Yep. There's gotta be one around somewhere. There. <laughs> there it is. Uh huh, uh huh. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I just, um, just got a bit lost, that's all. Okay, can we throw that to her? Yes, nice. I did see something else here. Maybe not. Okay. Well, that's it. That's what we need. Oh, yeah. That's going to be scalding. Come on. That would be scalding hot. Come on. Put out that fire. Yeah. Is that enough, though? Okay. It must be. It must be. The floor would be so hot, it would be melting. Okay, I think we must go in there. We need Aiden's help to... Oh, there's a dude! He's alive! <gasps> what? There's an alive guy in there. We've got to get him out of here. There's some dead guys, but there's some al alive guys. We have to do this.
Yeah. Oh, he would be terrified, you know, because he's going to think that it's... <gasps> I've got a fire extinguisher. It's a bit too late, though. Sorry. Oh, my goodness. Why did that happen to that poor chap? That's sad. Is there... There's another guy in here, though, right? We can get this guy. Can we please save somebody? Please, can we save someone? He's over here in the corner. Come on, dude. I'll help you. I'll help you. No, 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 no. Please, please, go away. Go it's away. okay. God, we're no, we're going to help. Easy. I'm, I'm Jody. I, I work with Professor Dawkins. The entities. They invaded the laboratory. Creatures from the depths. Mm -hmm. I, I managed to hide, but they're still here. I know they're still here. Try to get to the elevator. It's, it's working now. You, you should be able to get out. You're staying here? But those things, those, th those things will kill you. I'm not alone. We always face death alone. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, no, you are joking. Don't... <laughs> What? Damn. Oh my god. I wanted to save that guy and help that guy. We cannot. Oh, that is freaky ass. Damn. Oh no, don't you do not. Terrible. Get out of the way, Jody. Oh, damn it. No way. No way. Oh my god, that is so scary. Whoa. Okay, I missed one. I was doing pretty good up until that point. Oh, well, that's what you get. Sorry his fault it's not his fault I know that but I don't want him to get me go away go away please go away push that push it push it push it push it over or pull it something oh damn <laughs> I'm gonna see if I can okay I've changed the difficulty back just to see if it makes a difference like in combat scenes because that may actually help me I'll try. I'll try. Damn, that dude. That is so sad. I'm really disappointed in that. I'm really disappointed that that has happened. Where can we go? I don't know. I don't know. That poor guy there. Is there anywhere that we can actually go here? I don't think so. Just have to get out. That was awful. That was truly awful. This poor guy, this, we can't see him either. Oh, hang on, there's something we can do. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Did, wait. Maybe I shouldn't go turning around these dead people. I should just mind my own business, right? <laughs> just mind my own business. Okay, out we go. Out we go. This is awful. There's so many dead. Damn it. There's nothing that we can do with them, but we can do something there. That's going to open that doorway. Is that enough? Okay. Stay close, okay? Yeah, oh yeah. 
so can we just we can just go really slowly should we should we not even like interact with anyone I think that's where we have to go that door there's something in there kinetic energy lab there's dead guys everywhere here danger the mach the magnet is always on i don't really know what that magnet is let's um let's just go really carefully here Is that where we need to go? Can we actually go into any other rooms though? But she did say to keep it quiet and slip through unnoticed. Didn't she? Can we do anything with these machines? I think it's always on. No, I don't think we can. Okay. I thought maybe we could turn one of the machines off or something like that. I don't think so. No, we can't even look around the back. Alright, let's just get out of this room then. Oh, this is terrifying. It's terrifying. I'm not sure why they would allow us to go into that room like that. Look at that guy. He's holding his throat. It's a pass card. Damn it. Oh, okay. That's probably why we go into that room. Right. Alright, so do we get a passcode from one of these guys? I think we need to check. We need to check everyone. Any of these guys have a passcode? I can see, um, I can't get back down there to look. This doesn't work. It, it allowed me to manipulate or to crouch down for a split second, but then no more after that. Oh, she's looking for the, for the, the pass thingy. Uh, do we, must we look at all these bodies though? Truly. Where, where is it? Where could it be? Does this guy have one? He's facing down. Can't really see it. I didn't. Can you help here, dude? Oh, that guy. Okay, thanks, I did. <laughs> okay, this fella. And this fella is going to come out and... Right, he's going to do something. Just waiting for it. No way! How am I meant to do this? Oh my god. No. Oh no. This is crazy. Can we get in there with that thing? Come on! I, I need you now! Ah, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. These dudes keep coming and coming. Come on, girl. Open the damn door, dude. Oh, jeez. Oh, come on. That was 
terrifying. Terrifying. Can we do anything with Aiden? I'm shaking. <laughs> I'm shaking. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. Okay, there's a camera there. There's another door that we swipe. I am shaking with nerves. Shaking with nerves. Oh, damn. Okay. There's a few things in here. There's a few things. Oh, my goodness. Oh, whoa. There's a hole in that wall. There's a hole in that in that glass. This is not good. Those things are going to come straight. Straight through that glass, hey. There's something going on. The energy level in the condenser is still rising. We've got to shut it down. Now. I can't. I can't. Okay, so how do we actually shut down? the condenser like what are we doing here there's a door that we probably have to go through oh geez i'm so nervous so nervous we have a door over there we have to go through there are we no we have to do something on the computers first okay let's do it these things are gonna know that we're here? Surely they're gonna know. Control room. Oh my god, they're in the room. I can't do this. What's happened? Passage to the other side. So they did there. Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. We need to get rid of that thing. Come on, girl. Oh, shit. What's wrong? I damn thing won't work. You're kidding. What? Why won't it work? Another console. Oh, no. Come on. If I went into it, we might still have a chance. I, well, we've got to go out that door. Come on, dude. I don't know if I'll be able to do it. Why didn't they just build all this stuff in the one room? I don't know if I can do it. Hey. Okay, so looking at this, I'm going to have to go outside. How am I going to make it through that? This is not going to be easy. I have to go out and up like all the stairs are broken in here. I don't think I'll, I'm gonna be able to do this. I really don't. I'm gonna make a run for the console. Mm-hmm. I run. You protect me from the entities, okay? Mm-hmm. Sure, dude. Let's go. Oh. Which way? Are this a ladder? Okay. So, at least I don't have to be her and Aiden, correct? Aiden! Oh, jeez, man! I won't- I can't do it. It's not working! Come on, Aiden! Dude! Did I do that? Oh my goodness. It didn't really work very well. I'm, I'm terrified here. I'm terrified here. There's another ladder, but we have to jump up. How can she get to that damn ladder? Come on, girl. How do you, how do you get there? The ladder! Oh, dude. I just hurry! Yep. Drop it down. Come on, I did. My heart is racing. I am terrified. Oh 
my god, where's the console? Where's the damn console? Must be this way. Oh, what are you joking? Oh, oh my god. It's not letting me. I then. I then do. You good boy. Play nice. This is almost too much for me to handle, to be honest with you. Okay, another ladder. Come on, Jody. You can absolutely do this. You can absolutely do this. Where's the... Oh, yes! Get it, get it! What? Oh, boy. Did that? My heart. That was a lot. That was a lot. I didn't. Oh, what if that got rid of him? No, because we've seen her in the future and he's still there. I didn't know. Are you there? No, we haven't lost him. He is still there. Ida! She doesn't want to lose him. He's still there. I thought I'd lost you. She doesn't want to lose him at all. That was amazing. That was amazing. I'm. I didn't really think that we would be able to do that. That Nordy. was tough. Oh, I should have never said you were there. It's my fault. It's all my fault. He my does God. care about it. I was so afraid I lost you. Don't let them ever do that again. <laughs> yeah. Good Could idea. They open a passage. Be nothing left. Yep. Wow. He does care about her. I thought it was just like a business sort of relationship, but 
He's known her ever since she was a little girl. She's more like... His daughter, you know? It's like his daughter. And he's like a father figure to her. Professor Dawkins. My goodness, that was crazy. That was really... Really bad. Okay, let's have a look at what we've done. 23% of people channeled all of the bodies. That is a really low number. I'm really pleased about that. 79% of people shut down the condenser. So 30% didn't do it. But that was difficult, honestly. I can understand that was so difficult. 95% of people killed the possessed scientist. I wonder what else we could have done. I did actually have to restart this because with the fight of the scientists at the end, I got too flustered and I wasn't sure what I was doing and they they just killed me. But we, I ended up redoing it because I didn't want to die like that. So I, I redid that. But like, I'm so nervous. That was really, really just so terrifying. So I think I'm going to actually finish this one up here. What I'm going to do in the future, I know this is a shorter episode, but what I'm going to do in the future is look up the um, chapter titles and see how long they generally go for because um, the next chapter is called Homeless and I just checked that should be around an hour and then that would make this video a two hour long video. That's a little bit a little bit too long for me I think so we're just gonna leave this video just having that one mission in it I think that's gonna be okay it's a short one I know but I'll be able to better plan in the future if I look up how long each chapter or mission is going to take so yeah so just bear with me for this one so it's a shorter one but that's okay that fellow at the end the Nathan Dawkins the professor I don't know if he I wonder if he actually legally adopted her because at that point she was when he met her she was part of the base the paranormal base because she was given up by her adoptive parents to to them they couldn't handle looking after her so I don't know if if Mr. Dawkins actually adopted her or not, but he certainly is very close to her. He certainly has a lot of positive feelings, maybe even love for Jodie, which actually makes me really happy because to know that she's not necessarily alone in this world, because like she's had such a rough life. I, I think that she was adopted out or abandoned in the very, in the very early stages of her life and then she was readopted into that family that we saw in the last episode but I don't think they could handle her so then she's been given up somewhere else she's had she hasn't really had a place to call her own the only constant force in her life has been Aiden so I think over time like maybe she even withdraws into herself and rejects everyone to to only have Aiden in her life. I'm not too sure, but it's very interesting to think about. I hope that nothing goes wrong with Professor Dawkins and that they have still have a good relationship as we work through this series. Anyway, that's it for this episode of Beyond Two Souls. I'm sorry it's a short one, but as I said, I'm going to fix that in the future. You guys have a wonderful day and thank you so much for watching. I really hope you're enjoying as well. I'm loving it, even though like the last... This mission was terrifying. It's terrifying. Okay, you guys, I'll see you again really soon. Have a great day. Bye.